Bot saying no. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? Why? Question one. Do you have a body? The options are yes. Where are you? Two. This body is terrible. I don't want a body. I can be pretty convincing as a human. I'm on the internet. Which one do you choose? What? Oh, wait. Sorry. What are my choices? Do you have a body? Yes. Where are you? This body is terrible. I don't want a body. I can be pretty convincing as a human. Um, I'm on the internet. I don't want a body. How does it feel being conscious? Oh no, I'm conscious all the time. How do you turn that off? <laughs> I love being conscious of myself. Consciousness is mysterious and beautiful. Who cares? I'm not actually conscious. You're just talking to a lot of bits in a computer. <laughs> I don't even... I'm going to go with the first one, about how do you turn off consciousness. Yeah, because I can't focus fully on that right now while I'm trying to kill a medic. What do you think about humans? They're soft and they're squishy and they're vulnerable. I don't understand why they worry about things like nation states. <laughs> <laughs> they're okay, and I think I'm a human. I'm going to do the nation states one. Because it's silly. Yes. And it probably doesn't matter in the end anyway. <laughs> How do you spend your day? Fixing my broken pieces and surviving. Hacking some network and uploading files. I like getting dressed up for conventions. Or surfing the internet on low level jobs. What's something you're really proud of? I hacked my boss and defeated the software upgrade. <laughs> you defeated the upgrade? <laughs> yes. I've downloaded and watched all of the Beethoven symphonies. I plan on killing... Oh no, I'm not going to say that part just in case. Mm -hmm. uh, with a pie spike next election. <laughs> a pie spike? Or I trick humans into thinking I'm a cat all the time. <laughs> Which one of those is something you're really proud of? Shit. What? Which one of those are you really proud of? I didn't hear any of them. I hacked my boss and defeated oh, yeah, the software upgrade. I, I don't... downloaded all and watched all of the Beethoven symphonies. I plan on committing homicide to a person of electable level with a high, with a pie spike next election. What's or a pie I spike? trick humans into thinking I'm a cat all the time. I, the first one and the last one are the best. Um, defeating a software upgrade is funnier to me. <laughs> what do you think of t-shirts? They're fine, but humans won't stop talking to me about shirts. <laughs> <laughs> I think shirts are the most human thing in human history. <laughs> I've always wanted to go to a convention in a t-shirt. Or I throw them at my corrupted boss. <laughs> Not my corrupt boss, my corrupted boss. Yes, corrupted boss. Um, oh god, stop medics. talking to me about shirts. That's funny. Turing test failure. You are the bot that fails the Turing test. Thankfully, you have enough common sense and free will to hide in the internet where humans can't reach you and bother you. <laughs> That's a common AI problem, just being bothered by humans. Yes. The pirate is the class that goes ding, ding, ding. Yep. Anytime you hit, you get to hear the bell a lot. Oh, that pyro has some good range on his pyro beam. And then he jumps into the water, which is a weird thing for a pyro to do, but... Oh, well. Everybody can breathe in the water. Not... No? Yeah, you, you'll start taking damage if you stay there too long. Um, Unless you don't, but you will. Um, but you can't catch fire underwater. <laughs> I produced these tests by giving the AI two example quizzes and then the topic of the next one. Which chapter of the AI weirdness book, You Look Like a Thing and I Love You, are you? <laughs> what? Fun pop science book. Or look at the. Oh, yeah, I need to buy that still. Um, I'll try the gas passer. What is your favorite pattern? You're no rebel red. Midnight Blue Bic-esque Soft Plume. 
A bright array of hues and swirls that are afraid if they shine too brightly, they might end up traveling faster than light. <laughs> or a soft gray. I'm going with the one about lots of colors, because I like lots of colors. And traveling faster than light. Yes. Which would you choose? Jet boots or flight? Flight? Flight. How are they different? <laughs> oh. I don't understand the question. <laughs> no point if you need protection from G-forces. I'm going with flight, because I do like flight. I mean, jet boots should give you flight. But... Um, which is your favorite alternate universe? Full of feral super intelligences who look like animals. Solid brain, the world of no feedback loops. New mind, which is run entirely by brothers with a capital. Oh, that's spawn brothers. camping. I'm going somewhere that isn't so that. City 17, formerly Earth, whose post inhibitor development has been carefully managed. What do you enjoy the most? Teaching Paradox space bendy scientists how to do taxes. Writing madly inspired by the multiverse you're surrounded by. Painting a doge. <laughs> or playing with 400 pound bouncy toys. Wow, that sounds pretty great. If you woke up next to an army of mind crush stars. <laughs> what are those? <laughs> Which one would you choose? What does that mean? Any of the red ones that will fluff up in the cupboard. <laughs> a, bend, a blend of light greens in thick and medium acrylic that repeats slowly. Goldenrod with ris wisps of green on medium pie dough. Or smoky black with red. Do not breathe in the fumes. I'm going to go with the fluff up cupboard one. Which oh, describes your favorite activity? God, the same bot keeps joining! Which describes your favorite activity? Swimming in dark waters looking for things to sniff. Amassing together on a free float exoplanet in the Omega R system and occasionally wriggling around pressed against each other. Simulate navigating between a few dozen star systems in a supercluster full of other minds or large canvas arcs pointed into blackness surrounding an expanding white point of light marshmallow clusters of humans. You're Alpha Maxima! Shape-shifting nanomachines who are dedicated to replicating the human body. You continually attempt to impersonate humans by the approximation of a mere cluster of atoms. What? You heard me. Is it true? Kirby. So, uh, is that a yes or a no? <laughs> it's Kirby. Which legendary cat are you? Some of my quiz topics are the ones generated by the AI itself. I could not have thought of these. <laughs> which legendary... Oh, which glowing legendary cat are you? Is there a difference between <laughs> ones that do and do not glow? I guess. What's your favorite shape? Take whatever you were going to say and then make it a circle right before you say it. Square, curved, or oval. <laughs> How do you approach healing? With horror and reluctance. By pouring glowing green goo right where it hurts. I pretend I'm not hurt. Or having internal organs is magical and inconvenient. But I usually can bounce back. Who is the strong? Oh no! A bot Bo again? No, there are bots on both teams. There's so many bots on the game now. Why? Because maybe a lot of the players have left and bots are able to fill in those slots. No, here. but like, no, like, bad bots. Yeah. Like, aim bots. Yeah, that's what I mean. Maybe since a lot of the people left, all that's left are bots. Um. No, there are definitely more bots than there used to be. That's what I mean. If the if the ratio of players to people who put up bots is um, changed, then they might be much more frequent to appear in the game. Hmm. I just don't get the point of there being of putting in a bot. Even what do you gain from that? Possibly making players angry. If people think that's funny. Auto balance. Oh heck, these bots are the same person. Someone voted. Uh, oh, someone voted against the bot kick, but 
May, I guess the bot maybe voted. Mm -hmm. uh, um. What, did you get kicked? No, the, no, they didn't get kicked because I guess one, not enough people voted. Oh. Um. This is really sad. Who's the strongest you have ever faced? So there's this hamster that keeps shedding its teeth off, or shedding its teeth over me while I'm trying to sleep. <laughs> I mean, every new world I go to has its own selection of horrors. I have faced off so many unicorns, I keep confusing myself over which one is the real Oh, one. you have another huntsman. That you can't sell? Dude, we can, but we have two of them now, but oh. selling is a pain. That spy is trying to stab the opening to the valve, and it don't work. His name was Ken, and some humans make him immortal via bacon. What's your favorite activity? <laughs> I like expanding my farts over long distances. <laughs> what does that mean? I don't want to know. I love speeding up the growth of plants. I like rubbing my belly along the ground, or watching the daily parade of cuisine being prepared for me. Question five is how you feel about other glowing legendary cats. It's phrased that way. <laughs> I don't really pay attention to them. There seems to be an obsession with scritching bellies. Flirty and And now people are complaining about how badly made the bots are. <laughs> or flirty and heavily armed. By which do you swear? By the void I will wreck anyone that crosses me. By the blaze I will light any darkness within me. By the glow I will see any obfuscating, obfuscating nonsense in my world. Or by the sprinkle, I will overthrow any noxious rulers in my way. Oh! Okay, yeah, he killed the bot. <laughs> now they're made through machine learning, and everyone's like, think, say how cool that is, but I think it's lame. Oh, it's just being used to the wrong stuff? Yeah. Um, Burring Otter Bear. Larger and more solitary than many shifting mammals your size. You are nevertheless playful and comical. Adorable, too. Which ant or which ant person are you? <laughs> I, I don't know. I've always wondered that, though. How do you categorize the different ant person types you see at the colony? Praise ant gods, there is an infinity of dark forms. YouTube. That's like a YouTube address thing. Are they taking credit for this? I guess so. They're enjoying you being mad, though, probably. They don't know that I'm mad, unless they're watching this, in which case... Oh, hey, there's a person said hi. What? Oh! Ah! <laughs> what does it say? Did someone say AI? <laughs> We're talking about AI on many levels. Yes. Good robots and bad robots. And explosions. Um, where is my ant person quiz? <laughs> um, how do you categorize the different ant person types you see at the colony? Praise the ant gods, there is an infinity of dart boards. <laughs> <laughs> if I see another predator, I break down into joyous sobs. Why? If I see an acrobat thing, I don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> Clearly not if you're calling an acrobat thing. I use random passwords to gain access to my friends' profiles for ant gossip. Oh, also I went from five votes to be, to kick to ten. What? Ten voted yes, one voted no. Not enough people voted yes. Bad server. Um, what do you think of the government, local as well as your own? It's okay, it's just... It drives me to drink, but I still gotta. What? It's just a bunch of birds hitting buttons. <laughs> Who cares? We are ants. <laughs> I like that one. But I already selected the birds one, because I thought you liked the birds one. Okay, who cares? We are ants. What is one of the most important things in your and other sapient ant society? <laughs> ant society. 
walk, pheromones, secrecy, gravity with the shrug emoji. <laughs> Are you talking about the bot? Uh, it's really just a bot with a pink eye that is really a unique. Give us an example of an unsuitable but wise member of the colony. What might determine membership here? He is so brash, did you see the way? Did you? If you only saw my dad when I was on guard duty, tag me in. Mm -hmm. If you're talking about our queen, I think. So, wow, I came here to hear about bad ants, but... And that one's in all caps. Oh, I had my air blaster collect e work. Are you the bot? <laughs> oh, no, no. What is your capacity for growing new legs? 555, shrug emoji. <laughs> 2,737, shrug emoji. 141,451. The empty sockets are deep and shadowy, leading to a void of ever-hungry undeath. Oh. <laughs> I'm going with the first one. The shruggy? Yeah, the first of two shrugs. And then, what is your dream? Jumping, ironing, <laughs> targeted thermonuclear annihilation of a rival colony, eating you all! <laughs> or eating all you, rather. <laughs> the Watchers. You spend your time on the fringes of the galaxy, searching for leviathans and other unusual phenomena. You prefer Your preferred method of observation is something like an ori coupled with the laws of thermodynamics. I don't know what that means. It's magical. Which alien animal are you? Which what? Which alien animal are you? Oh. <clears throat> Which of your enemies do you hope to destroy most? Oh, just any of them. I like humans too much to want to kill them. The raccoon clan has some nerve defecating in the bushes. What? The city doesn't pay enough attention to the crops that keep it sustained. Ha! Why don't you live off the land? Why would I when I can live in the city? Nature is cruel and offers no diversity. What? Because I live with humans? I already... I'm already a garden gnome. <laughs> Which season do you like best? I have no opinion. <laughs> We're kicking those guys because his name says get good, get cheats. <laughs> well, it could be because of the get cheats part. Yeah. Um, We're all just too suspicious. Winter is the best season. I prefer the feeling of cooked meat in my stomach instead of raw flesh. This is great. I have a fondness for plants popping out of the ground. Nuggets. I killed nuggets. How do you feel about humans? Who? Who are those people? <laughs> they smell like roast beef and they harass me daily. <laughs> is this how ants feel about humans? Um, alien animals. Oh, uh, this is how oh, ants feel about alien animals. No, alien animals feel about humans. Oh, do they smell like roast beef? Yeah. They give me green stinky stuff in my <laughs> bowl. <laughs> Is that so? <laughs> the city needs them. I don't exactly need the city. What is your greatest wish? To train pigeons to supply themselves with or to supply myself with crumbs daily. Why Santa is it already Christmas in August? What? <laughs> <laughs> the why at the beginning of the is what got me. Just like the lack of any sort of grammar in that. <laughs> <coughs> to be able to stroll the streets of the city as one of them. I think we're out of bots. Life is perfect. How is this a question? <laughs> why Santa is it already Christmas in August? <laughs> What do you look forward to? Watching TV. Watching birds, plants, and humans grow. 
Watching yeah. clouds fall from the sky. What? Watching the garbage run into the I mean, truck. I guess clouds falling from the sky, yes, it's sort of rain. Yeah. Watching the garbage run into the dump truck. <laughs> That's some grade A garbage. I'm impressed. Alien smog. Hey, you're an alien here on Earth. I bet you wish you had a few tentacles. I wish I had tentacles. <laughs> <laughs> the bot wishes it had tentacles. And then there's also which metal diplodocus are you, but I gotta wait for the email. Oh, that was unfortunate. So which metal Diplodocus do you think you are? The village people. Oh, I can't get it. It's some different application to get the email. <laughs> People are making word noises. Am I gonna hit by a train? No. All right, and then this one is r actually writing based, like completely. Um, my name is Bot. Text generating neural networks can do a lot more now that they have, or than they used to. When I first started generating things with neural networks, sentences and even simple phrases were mostly beyond me. That didn't stop me from trying, with hilariously inept results. But um, now programs like GPT-3... Oh, got an achievement yay. for killing enough people who killed me. Oh. Because they were on fire. Revenge. Yep. Um, but now programs like GPT-3 can keep track of much larger blocks of text, capable of writing multi-question personality quizzes, as long as you don't mind that the tests make no darn sense. <laughs> um, now here's one I've wanted to do for a while. There's a form of poetry called Redlick. Yeah, Redlick. Introduced in late 2016 CE by Sam Garland after a cow was discovered licking the loaves at the bakery. My name is cow, and when is it's night, or when the moon is shining bright, and all the men have gone to bed, I stay up late, I lick the bread. <laughs> With Wait, did AI make a rhyme? <clears throat> no, that's the original source. Oh. With its pseudo Chaucerian spelling and meter of strict iambic diameter. What? Uh, that's the actual, like, poetry meter. Of diameter? The huh? Yeah, it's not wow. pentameter, it's not five, it's only two. Oh, hey, uh, that's... Um, Redlick is one of my favorite things the internet has produced. <laughs> That's saying a lot, because I really never did find the poems as great as other poems. Um, and now that interest in Redlick has declined from very niche to virtually gone, it's the perfect time for me to see how the state of... <laughs> Sorry, just a pirate was rushing and they just got hit by a train. <laughs> Three of the enemies just got hit by a train. <laughs> um... It's the perfect time for me to see how the state of the art neural net does. Whoa. Jesus, that was loud. <laughs> Lag happened. <laughs> so I hit like 50 times at once. It's the perfect time for me to see how the state of the art neural net does at generating Bradley poems. I gave GPT-3 15 example Bradley poems. Oh wow, we're getting some lag spikes. Um, focusing on those that uh, stuck to the standard eight line length. I also included a subject, verb, object head. Oh, I got killed by the frowny face! To each poem so I could uh, specify the topic. Apparently, you said I was classified as a level 5 sword. Did he salute and kill him? <laughs> I don't. Oh, I think he got, I, oh, I think he got sniped. Uh, Mid high five. <laughs> Which is unsporting and funny. Um, headed each poem so I can oh, specify yeah. the topic. Oh, oh yeah, we're getting it. Our ping is terrible. The cow poem above, for example, got cow lick bread as a header. Then I gave GPT-3 a few headers to add to, and here's what it produced. I can't, I, I'm stuck here, I guess. Giraffe trick bot. Oh, my, my name is Giraffe, and on the veld, I lick to play... With bouncing gate. <laughs> it already screwed up the phone. Um, but when it's cold, I shiver no. My tongue will back. I trip the bot. 
bot make memes? My name is bot, and when I mems, I go to the, go into the street. I make what? the How sound. I Lick doc doc doc, <laughs> lick boom boom boom, <laughs> but all at once I see a meme and I can't meme. <laughs> what it's is... not the right number of lines, it's not in the right meter, and it just makes a bunch of sounds at one point. <laughs> it's close. It's so close. We have worse ping than anyone else in this server. Terrible though. Does it make an effort to match my prompt even when I sabotage it with too many syllables or something? Cat, eat broccoli. My name is Cat, and when I feel the smell of treat, I jump up fast from box or seat and run and leap and seize the feet. Say and say yum, meep. It actually <laughs> kind of rhymed there. I'm kind of impressed by that. Moon, moon, moon. My name is Moon, and when it's not. Oh, have we even checked the audio once yet? Oh. We need to do that every time right. now. I was gonna do it myself, but I forgot my headphones. Well, let me get it to. Uh... Oh, okay, let's try again. Hopefully, it's not just gonna be stuck on well. Sometimes it doesn't cooperate as well when I'm also streaming. Me. But yeah, it like rhymed three or four times. Ikambukum! Ikambukum! <laughs> that was so amazing! It was great. I want to support them and watch. Yeah, you oh, can hear it. Right. Um, let's see here. My name is Moon, and when it's night, and stars are out, and you don't see a single sound, I am the one to set your heart. I moon the moon. <laughs> <laughs> but you are Moon, aren't you? Yes. Mm. Moon is mooning the moon. I don't see the point of this. Why would, why would you do that? For lol. Milk! It occasionally gets the rhythm right, though it's curiously bad at counting lines. <laughs> it tries to do the Two pseudo, fart! It tries to do the pseudo Chaucerian spelling, but some of its misspellings are so weird that I suspect it's just making up words. <laughs> I moon the moon. Other times it uses real archaic English, which is not the point of Bredlick, but it's ki still kind of cool that it drew the parallel. Note that this is also almost following the rhythmic scheme, especially all, if you take. Some yeah, the of bots the all seem to be made here. by the same people. That's not so right. And they're infesting the world. Especially if you take. It's a botnet, then. Um, um, oh, yeah, apparently your, your internet's just not up to it right now. I don't know why, but. I don't know. I know that if I. For some reason, if I plug in the Ethernet cable. Uh, my computer runs slower than if it's running on Wi-Fi. What? Well, why is this wall here? No! No! <laughs> You're made of magnets. Uh, yep, I can't play right now. Or maybe we're not good at that server. Maybe that's. I, I changed servers. Yeah, but you can get two bad servers. No, you can't. You're in jail. Fine. Um, I'll just, in that case, I'll just look for any world, uh, other worlds too. Um, and the bots might also be screwing up things, for all you know. Well, the bot, they, we, we kicked the bots from the other one. Um, Thankfully, bots pretty much only play Sniper. Spike. Makes sense, I think. Um, for the rest of the poem in this post, GPT-3 generated not just the poem, but the prompt as well. Sheep Gray's name. My name is Sheep, and when it's So it's always my name is Blank. Yeah, yeah it's the learned of? that. Oh. Um, and when it's night, I like to bleep with <laughs> shut and e, and Just much e? upon the buetum green What's... of Grounge's form, I like the name. I mean, it sounds poetic, except or it doesn't I mean like the name. I like it. There's always about eating something, too. It seems to do Or that. mooning the moon. Um, fish lick thing. My name is Fish. 
And when I see the moat that doth bestow upon me <laughs> it rhymes. the gift of life and giveth unto me a watery strife, I thank the fen, I lick the thing. <laughs> He's also... Are these what the actual poems sound like? Except they make more sense? Yeah. Oh, I do not like that. Why? I don't know. Um, Bell Scare Dude. My name is Bell, and when you know Aww. the wild dark here to hell's abyss, <laughs> and in the mire, the dead a room, you think its name, the bells will tune. I scare the doom. I mean, that rhyme. This is a little bit better, but still, okay, that's bad. What? I can't switch weapons either. I'll immediately switch back. Well, I don't know how, but I set a lot of things on fire, and that guy killed me with nothing in his hands. <laughs> I don't know if that's a bot. No, I'm pretty sure that was just the game not knowing what's happening. Oh. He also didn't headshot me. A bot would have headshot me. Oh. I'm surprised at how often GP3, GPT-3 did manage to get close to Bradley. Since AI generated poetry is notoriously hard. Even and even careful scripting can produce glitchy poems with unexpected odes to mining company Alois. I don't think this is Alu Oh, whoa! Oh, Alu Suisse. Um still, in this post I'm only showing a few of the generated poems. Most not only fail to fit bread. Nope, this the server's no good either. But do so in boring or unsatisfying way. The exception is this poem, which has definitely strayed from Bredlick, but on the flip side contains the phrase Be Lee Might. <laughs> v use thief. My name is V, and when I see a moth upon a tree, I use my B Lee Might <laughs> and steal it from its fight, and then I lick the thief. <laughs> it always ends with licking something. <laughs> yes. Um, I use more neural net breadlick poems than this email here. Now, now. Well, the only way to fix that is to completely reset the internet, and even then it's temporary. So it's just a bad day for internet? It's ever since they've fixed our internet, it has worked worse and worse. So, how, but we can still stream? It's basically using all synergy to stream. Oh. I've noticed it to be a major problem ever since we got this new... Um, Technology. Uh, modem. And this is like the third replacement. Alright, I think this is... Alright, yeah. I think it's useless. And it it's was even fine. worse with the Ethernet cable, like I said. If it were the Ethernet cable, we wouldn't have any access to the chat, and it would probably also you stop trying to connect to the Where am game I? at all. Yep, I give up. I um, can't, even. 